You are watching Seniors Protest Beside Church of Global Kingdom Ministries. Toronto, Ontario Huge number of seniors, 279 and counting, who thought that they were investing in a condominium project have found out that there is no condo and no down payment refund. Sadly after a long time these seniors are still waiting. This condominium and building complex has attracted many seniors because they also guaranteed that if the condominiums were not built, then all deposits would be returned since the church had an asset base of $30 million. Condo purchasers were told that the project may have to be restructured and they could call the office and apply for refunds, the purchasers are still waiting for their refunds, and Trinity Ravine Community Inc. has filed for bankruptcy. Church lawyers are taking advantage, as seniors, many of whom are, handicapped, suffering from anxiety, stress, and unable to sleep, new immigrants not able to communicate effectively in English, and who have no knowledge of how the legal system works. Seniors were told by church representatives that they could buy a condominium that offered, support services, amenities and programs, service packages, and health and wellness. They thought that by having these services available they would be able to live independently and not have to rely on or compete for long-term care spaces provided by the government. One of the pastors of Global Kingdom Ministries, Pastor Kern Kaladin, who was listed in the legal documents as the pastor, so in all fairness, I wanted his side of the story, and this is what Kaladin revealed via email. I am not employed by Global Kingdom Ministries. I will have someone send you a statement. That statement came from another pastor, Bob Johnson, who sent an email that read like this. The project you are referencing was under the purview of the Trinity Ravine Community Incorporated. The following statement is attributable to Global Kingdom Ministries. We were deeply disappointed that Trinity Ravine Community Inc. entered into the CCA process. When this project was first imagined years ago, we were hopeful that it would be beneficial to our community. The church will be conducting an internal review of the decisions leading up to the CCAA process. According to a seniors who are currently awaiting her refund the people behind the so-called condo project are not forthcoming about handing over the refunds as promised to the aging would-be homeowners. Church corruption, pre-planned fraud or just very unfortunate circumstances? There are many questions, and no answers, as church officials are remaining silent, passing from one pastor to another.
church corruption, pre-planned fraud or just very unfortunate circumstances? There are many questions, and no answers, as church officials are remaining silent, passing from one pastor to another. 